here. You are back with some more Legends Osseus. Last time we spent a bunch of time exploring in the Obsidian Fieldlands, I believe it is, the first area. We uh, we used Surf a bunch, we kind of just collected resources, we did some rifts, all sorts of things, and we pretty much explored the entire rest of the area that we hadn't previously explored. Um, let me just kind of go in here real quick. There are maybe a few small things I have left that I should do if possible. But we got the main stuff here. There's like nothing. I think I still need to find a combi on Ramanas Island for a quest. And I need a few more like Abra and probably Luxray over here. And like a, the Alpha Snorlax and more Alpha Heracross and stuff. But like just, just little things that aren't super urgent. I can fly here? No, okay. It's just like marking it as a fly point. Um... Yes, yeah, so we did that last time with our, our surf ability, and today I want to spend some time uh, going through the Crimson Islands and the Cobalt Coastlands, doing some surf stuff that we haven't done before. What are you? Is this a a mass outbreak? Oh, oh, oh! Well, had that. That's the first time I've seen a mass outbreak in a while. Uh, and then after we do these, if we have the time, we'll start exploring the Coronet Highlands. But uh, in the meantime. The first thing I want to do is evolve Cleet. We got him to the point of evolution last time, it just got late and I wanted to hold off on it. Let's just say hi to Cleet one last time before we evolve him. God, who's a good Cleet? Yes, you are. So true, bestie. Oh crap. Oh, and at some point we might also want to try to clear out some of our Pokemon in our boxes. But we'll worry about that a little later. So I kind of want to go take a look at that if out on immediately. Oh. I don't know how long that lasts. Oh, you are, you are wider and tall, especially taller than I would have thought. Damn, Overquill, you are something, all right. Whoa, you you're something. How did you get- what is this noise? This is like li higher pitch than the previous one. Oh, you look angy. <laughs> I like it. Okay, we have a couple quick quests. That look like they popped up, so I want to take a real quick peek at those. Tell me, tell me, please! Hey, what's that Pokemon up there? What's its name? What's it do? What? Oh, it's a Magikarp! Magikarp? Why is it called Magikarp? Is it a cool Pokemon? Is it strong? Can it fly? Uh, it's very strong. And it can fly. It's pretty cool. I don't want to crush your dreams. It's cool! Why is it cool? What part is cool? Tell me, tell me! Tell me more, please! Please! You're gonna go learn about Magikarp, right? Can you tell me when you're all done with its page and your Pokédex? <laughs> I already have it, so we got this on lock. Is Magikarp's page filled yet? In yet? Tell me, tell me. We got Magikarp yesterday, funny enough. We got the whole page. I know all about Magikarp now! I'm a Magikarp professor! <laughs> yes, you are! Now it's my turn to tell you something. Senkwa told me a secret. Senkwa said she made those Magikarp statues, but she said she really wanted to make Gyarados statues instead. She said that Gyarados is super strong and cool, it can even fly! A apparently. And that Magikarp can become Gyarados! You'll tell learn more about Gyarados too, right? Please! Aw, oh, it's a two-parter! <laughs> oh, why do you have a rare candy? This is, we're gonna have to learn about Gyarados. Yeah, that one we're nowhere near. We were having trouble catching, like, a Gyarados last time. What? What is any of this? I can't... What the fuck? Okay, wait. I'm gonna try this. Great choice. All yours. Oh, a thunder. Oh, 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 okay. So these are items. So that was a thunderstone. I wonder if these are evolution items then. Mechanical tub. Mechanical box. Do we want to do them? I mean, we can. We have the money. Fuck it. I gotta say, you have a fine eye. A few others would recognize the value of a perplexing item like this. Its insides are packed with gears and machinery that serve some unclear purpose. 
But if you can solve this item's mysteries, your reward will surely be far greater than the price you paid for it today. Well then, I'll get this sent to your quarters. Free of charge, of course. Wait, what? What? My quarters? What do you mean you're sending it to my quarters? Is this like a Rotom thing? It's a washing machine you bought from the Ginkgo Guild, but using it would waste water. Pfft. These are Rotom things, aren't they? So I wonder if Rotom's gonna be in the next area. Fuck it. Kind of a box. Oh, you, oh, you fucking, you upscaled the price, you son of a bitch, fine. Great choice, all yours then. Gotta say, you have a fine eye. Few of us would recognize the value, blah, blah, blah. It's inside the back of a gear machinery. If you can solve it, it's mysteries. Or we'll surely figure out the price you put it. Okay. Do you have anything new? Won't be long until we restock. Hope you I went inside. There might be tomorrow in real life time. Although we'll have to see. I'm still not sure exactly how that works. Yeah, it's a road of mic. It's a microwave. The microwave oven you bought from the Genko Guild, but cooking is Benny's job. I think what's funny about it is it's literally just modern day appliances that must have come through the rift. Um, it's like about that's just very funny to me. Uh, okay, is this thing like a couple quick things that we can do? Or this one? I think that's really it. At least at the current moment. We might have something for the Buizel. We should probably just check. I have some new styles in stock. Please feel to have a look. What can I... About your request. You caught the shellos I asked about. I'd like to see the pink one first then. I don't think it just goes away. But we, we have caught both shelloses. I think we got the pink one second. Yeah. We didn't catch too many of these because we just didn't need them. Could you show me the light blue one now too? I like how it doesn't highlight the color. This is just fucking evil for like colorblind people. <laughs> it's quite beyond me why Shellos would have different colors, but I think it's absolutely charming that they change things up depending on where they live. It's kind of cute seeing them together. We here in Jubilife City have also journeyed far from where we used to live. Maybe a change in color of our clothing is what we need, just like Shellos. Yes, I've got it! I took advantage of the inspiration I was feeling and expanded my lineup. I'd be very pleased if you would have a look. Shellos of the East and West. I have no clue what you... Oh, you have another quest immediately. Uh, if I may, would you please... Uh, would, would it please you if I expand the variety of clothes I carry? Definitely. To seek new clothing is a true calling of any fashion-conscious person, after all. If I need some inspiration to come up with new designs, I'd like to see the Pokemon Wormadam. You have a specific one? Oh, you just want Wormadam in general? I don't even change my clothing, which is what's so funny about all this. Or maybe she might want to see all of them, I feel like. So this is what's known as a trash cloak. It's living proof that there is truth in the saying, one person's trash is another's treasure. I never knew Pokemon were capable of such things. Yes, I've got it! I'd be very pleased if you would have a look at my the latest additions to my cloth ear. Oh, I, I just need one of them? I'm kind of surprised that it was only one. I'm still really happy with like the clothing we have, and I have no way of knowing what's new. Which kind of makes this awkward. So why would we, uh, still, why would we run around in a suit? I have no clue what has been added that's new. I do really wish they would say new like they did in Sword and Shield. Because I have no clue what is new and what isn't. Uh, I think that's everything here. Do we really quickly, let me go to the training grounds real quick. See if there's anything that can be learned by Overquill. I don't think that's how this works, to be honest. I haven't seen this, like, change anything, but I'm curious.
curious. That doesn't look like it. Everything is special. Which sucks, so there's good moves here, but all of them are just special, and we're a physical attacker by a large margin. Uh, we can also check if Cleet learned anything upon evolution real quick. Oop, not that. 7 foot 10, Jesus Christ, you're massive. Nope, wait, cancel. Sorry, change moves, there we go, third time's the charm. Um, oh, we don't need Bar Barrage anymore. But that's all we really needed. Okay. Right. Okay, let's take a real quick peek. See if we have any weasels that are 2'8 or taller. Very last thing I'm doing. And then we will head off. And at some point, yes, we will organize this probably more. Oh, do we want to take we want to take a look at these guys too, I think. Hmm. Mmm, that's a good nature for a female one. Like, all of these have been female. Supposedly female and male- I actually talked to Bridget about this, are supposedly 50-50 to spawn. But, we have only found female ones. Not a single male one. Um, which is just weird. I know I caught a couple weasels. I caught one that looked- I thought looked big. Six. Five, two, four, two, five. Maybe we need to catch him in like a different location. Although we've caught him in two different locations. Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, I am rushing to go try to figure out that Hippowdon thing, not gonna lie. Which, we don't have the best team for right now, I realize. Or, like, our two lowest level Pokemon do not go well against Hippowdon, but that's okay. Because, yeah, there's the increased shiny chance. Um, let me, let me grab a couple of the better balls, just in case we find a shiny. Okay, well, that doesn't work anymore. We probably could craft some, but I know we have some lying around. Uh, what do we have? We have... Like, all sorts of things. Alright, go, go, go. Uh, I think in this case, we'll use you. We're going the right way, I would assume. I think so. Bit of a trek. We also have yet to do a, um... What's it called? Now I'm, I'm blanking. We've yet to do a, um... FaceTime Rift thing here. Uh, which seems like they have different Pokémon in different areas, so I'm genuinely curious about that. I still don't know how the outbreaks work, to be honest. They just seem to randomly occur. I mean, it could be one of those things, too, where they become more common once you uh, beat the game. Or once you do, like, a certain event or something. I really don't know. Yeah, so this is going to be our first goal. And then after that, we will focus more so on... Um, you know, surfing around some of the areas we haven't been able to previously access. Did I not? I did. Wait, where is this? Am I looking in the wrong... Am I crazy? Where is this? I might not see this on the map. Or on the... Oh, it's over there! I'm going the wrong way! Um... Huh. I'm a Dumbo. I thought it was over here. Pretend I'm not stupid for just just a sec. While I'm here, may as well grab this. God, I love Caster Ferns. I don't think we have Hippowdon at level 10 yet, so... 
There's potential to be beneficial in more ways than one. Even worst game, even if we don't find a shiny here, still may end up being valuable in some regards. Last time we had one of these was when we got the Scyther. It's literally been like a week since we found one of these. There's gotta be some way of making them more common. Whether that's by sleeping in game a bunch or something. I mean, unless they are just legit super rare. Yep, there's a bunch of hip add-ons. Yeah, real quick, let's take a look at just the book. It's gonna make this much easier. Okay, CDFGH. Okay, right about here. Oh no, we are at level 10. Okay, well, then we can just feign anything that's not shiny. I don't know how many male versus female we have. But we're just gonna go through all these. What level are you, 40? Okay. For now, we just hit the energy balls. Yep. Oh, I whiffed that. No, I'm, I'm legit just here to see if I can find shinies. And it seems like I just don't have a need for any of the other ones. Or for anything that's not shiny because I'm level 10. No luck so far. I don't know what the odds are. So, like, there's no guarantee we're going to get a shiny here. There's just a lot of them in this one puddle. I don't have a very good idea of what these shinies even look like, to be honest. Back up slightly. They're uh, still spawning. I'm like, I could try to catch some, but... There's not much of a purpose to it, I don't think. How many spawn in these mass outbreaks? They're still going. Uh, let's save a little PP. Let's try a Shadow Ball. Because we got it unaware. And not like catching these would not be a bad thing by any means. It's just there's not really a need. I guess we should test if Psychic one-shots. I mean, they're still spawning. I don't know, yeah, I don't know how many spawn in these mass outbreaks. It's gotta be quite a few, though. Okay, Psychic's not a one-shot, unfortunately. Ow. Oh, it was a crit. I was like, that did a lot. Okay, that looks like this is the last bunch. Okay, I don't think we're gonna get a shiny. So I will take them all out. We put the Elvis Gun Tank before, I wonder. Uh, we may as well use all our energy balls, to be honest. What is that one doing in the corner? One of them, I think, just straight up ran away. It seems like it's caps at like five of them spawning. I'm like, do I want to try to catch any of them? Not really much of a purpose. Other than it's just kind of funny.
Okay, well, neither of those worked. Uh, I, <laughs> unlucky. Just luck of the draw, I guess. Can I sneak up with the heavy ball? Nope! Well, we're gonna catch none of these. <laughs> eh, it's life sometimes. Cool. Yeah, no luck there. Oh well. Uh, do we want to fight one? Do we want to fight this guy? Wing balls have been historically not great on on Alpha Pokemon. I feel like. Fortunately. Yeah, okay, we don't actually have a need for this. Nope, it's gonna take that up. Um, I'm gonna move behind this rock. You took that like stupidly well. Strong style. Okay, I want to make sure we kill that. I think everything else around here is level 10. I don't actually have a need to catch this thing. I'll give it like one more shot, but if I fail a second time, then... I'm just gonna let it be. And thank you for the follow! Is that another one? There's two of them here? Jeez! My god, you almost saw me instantly. Yo man, what's up? Not much, not much. What's up with you? How you doing? I keep like getting little tripped up. I don't even need this thing. I'm trying way too hard to get something I don't have any actual need for. Oh my goodness, dude. Well, that didn't work. No? Yeah, well, I guess we'll go for the faint. Oh, cool, there's also a head pad on here. Lovely. Um. No, I think we should do regular. Well, it killed itself. Oh, we at least get the rewards of the Alpha Pokemon. I'm just gonna run from this Apatahan. I don't wanna deal with it. Oh, crap. Let's see. I guess we try to fight the other Scun Tank real quick. For the rewards. I can get this right. Come on, get up there. Maybe the other side. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess we just go with a different Pokemon. So it's gonna be Poison Dark. I don't know if we have anything good with Cleave to attack with it. I guess if we catch it off guard. Either that or we just try to catch it. Which would be the second goal. Over this way. Same level, higher, lower, about the same, I think. Actually, it might be a little bit lower. Woo! Okay, we got it! Lovely. Um, don't really have anything else here I need to specifically do, I don't think. 
just gonna grab this really quick and go from there. Um, this was actually a bit cool now that I think about it, because now we're just gonna attract the attention of everybody else. Um... Oops. Oh, well! <laughs> Um, I guess we go for this even though it's gonna have a Pokemon. Look at that Krogunk there is drowning. Yeah, I guess we'll fight it. May as well go for the faint. Let me see real quick too. Anything on our Saluna? Jesus camera! Spinning me around. Wait, where did it, where, where'd it go? This way? What is happening with this? Oh, there it is. There we go. Okay, well, uh oh. Oh! That is awkward. Let's try to get like a reset here. Play it safe. Rip. Yeah, this would be the other Wormadam, although it doesn't seem like Wormadam. I don't need all the forms of Wormadam, so. What did I just kick? Uh... Hold on. Gee, I kicked my thing on accident. My mod... Oh, give me one sec. What the fuck? Let me... Quickly... Not do that. Do that. Okay, what the heck? What did I... Okay, what? I think I unplugged my monitor somehow. One sec. I did. Wow. Jesus. I, I have like a little stool as a footrest, right? And when I kicked it, it like pulled up, I guess, uh, just enough on the monitor to uh, fuck things up. Okay, I don't think that really messed anything up on stream, thankfully. I hope it didn't, at least. Everything's still playing normally. What I can tell. Okay. That is awkward. I'm gonna have to be more careful of that. It's never happened in my many years at this point I want to say of having it this set up. Okay, all that for hardy grains. Gimme! Coming through! I'm just gonna kinda head somewhere safe and so I can teleport. is more likely to be aggressive than you are. Okay, what do we want to do here? So, we can see like the areas where we have not explored. I don't know how we would have explored this little bit, funny enough. Maybe there's a bridge that I'm not seeing. But yeah, we have not explored a lot of this general area and a little bit over here. I guess this is like the smallest part. Or maybe we go over here first. And then, yeah, we take a look kind of in this area. And then we haven't gone this way, although I don't know how far we can go that way. And then there's over here. We also, um, sometimes we want to go back over here, try to fight. There's a couple, there's Hunt, both Honchkrill and Roserade Alphas that we have yet to, Benny, we've yet to fight, so. That would be potentially nice. Okay, I guess I should use some do some quick crafting with apricorns related things. Um I guess we could stock up on some better balls. Preemptively. Because they might start coming- I think they're going to start coming handy in the next area. Where are we 
are we exactly trying to go? Okay, I think so. We're gonna go through the the Ursa Ring bit a little bit. I think, or the yeah, the Ursa Luna Ursa Ring. Oh wait, never mind. We're gonna do this. I think where is it? Close. Oop, I didn't really mean to zoom in. Oh, I think. Oh my God, it's exactly where I was planning on going anyway. Yeah, well, we'll just gather a few of these resources because it's gonna take a sec for it to. Start. So I want to know. It, so it seems like the items remain the same. But I'm curious if the Pokemon should hypothetically be different than what we've previously seen. Oh shit, it's Burmy. Once we go over there, it gets harder to get back down. Just do an item check now, okay. So we've realized more and more that hidden items are, are quite the important thingy. Oh boy. Alright. you. Let me... I'm gonna quickly message from Henna because you guys give her you. Yeah. I'm going there in just a sec. Might as well do a little bit right over here. Curious if there was like an alpha teddy or something. Is that an alpha ghastly? Is it just a regular ghastly? No, it's just a regular ghastly. Okay, I don't even need to go over there then. Okay, let's get in here. We can just do whatever once we're in here. Oh, who's angry at me? Oh, it's already starting. Wow. Okay, perfect timing. Shards galore. Oregon 2! That's sick as hell. Alpha Eevee. A Heracross. First time I've seen Alpha Eevee. Yeah, we start this always by just going around getting items. Riffle and Floatzel. Anything up here? No. We would have gotten most things by now. Go over this way a little more though. And not that we need to grab literally everything, but... More the merrier for sure. Nothing there, I don't think. Um, is that everything? No, there's a few things here. Now I think we've gotten everything? I think you're gonna let me do this. There it is. You seem like it pulls Pokemon from... It seems like these like pull Pokemon from other areas, essentially. Which is very interesting. Luxury. 
Wow, we're fixated on a move? Looks like we can. But we can always attempt to. Yeah, so a lot of Pokemon we've seen already. But they are Pokemon we haven't seen much of in raids previously. The... Nice. Switch to, like, Crunch. This is the Pokemon. Whoa. Oh, we, we get like a bonus for the fixation? I thought it was gonna be like outrage. Hopefully we catch this. Got such a long nose. <laughs> Alright, let's see Let's go. Awesome. Love to see it. I don't need Drift Blim, unfortunately. No, neither of those caught. Hopefully I get the Flareon. Awesome. Hmm, get this Porygon too. Okay, well that didn't work. Did not mean to stand up there. This is probably gonna end pretty soon. No! Okay, well, I'm gonna try to fight it to catch it then. So I actually need Heracross for my, my decks. Um... Can live one of those, right? Yeah. That was a crit. Okay. That was pretty weak. We take him. Yeah, I still have yet to find any shinies in the in these. I kind of feel like they might not be able to spawn here. It seems like there must be an increased chance here, but given the fact that they just like actively despawn. Oh, that's bad. Or good if I catch it here. <laughs> it almost seems that way, but anyway. Um, come on. <sighs> You're kidding me, it's gonna kill itself. Come on. Heracross is genuinely so nice here. Be nice to me, game. Ugh! Don't double edge. Don't double edge. You mother okay, well, back in the grass we go. Maybe time in battles doesn't count toward that. What? That's a little bit cheating. Thankfully, we should be okay here. We only caught it unaware. I'm just gonna kill it. I don't need any more Drift Blooms. I don't wanna risk another Pokemon spinning. The fights kind of delays how long the rift stays up. That's a crit. Oh, it's gonna faint because of the splinters. Unlucky. Didn't think that through. That's okay. Fainting still helps us for completion. Not happen. 
Well, that's a bit of a rip. Uh, okay. Fly back. What do we even get from this? I'm curious. Woo, Petra Berries! Uh, a Dusk Stone's pretty nice. Fire Stone is not as needed, but we take it. Okay. Could have been worse. Wait, did I rest already? I wasn't paying attention. No, I didn't. We'll do some quick crafting. Me, we'll hold off on dying on the professor, I think. There's no need to submit yet. We can get higher on the bonuses. Uh, now we can actually just a bunch of great balls. We, we burn a lot in those rifts, unfortunately. Okay. What do you smell, boy? This way, okay. Is it where that one proverb was? Yeah. Hmm. You know what? Not the worst. Okay. I want to take a quick peek, see if there's any alphas around. And then... I think we, we had this direction here. Gotta be careful we pick the right way. Not toward the waterfall, because there's a lot more area over there. No Alpha Teddy Ursus. We've only seen the Alpha Teddy Ursus a little bit. Don't even need to catch these. Okay. I guess if it sees me, it's fine. I don't really care if they see me. They're not uh, as big of a hassle as some other Pokemon. Give me the leaf! Wait, there's something here. Hang on. Fire Shroom. Oh, Barboach. I'm so excited to struggle to catch those in a bit. It's gonna be exciting, I'm sure. Are you a worthwhile level? No. Not worth the effort on ya. I think we saw the Alpha Barrel. Never mind, I'm not seeing an Alpha Barrel. There's a Yum over there. Pretty crazy, we haven't seen any of those. I want to take a quick peek at the uh, Alpha Ursa Ring and Teddy Ursa area, see if I find anything cool. I don't even need to catch it. I just benefit from feigning it. Wow! It makes such cute sounds. 40, oh yeah, we could take a 41. It's gonna outspeed and hit me here, but... Oh no, it's not. I keep wanting to instinctively go for Aqua Tail when Poison Jab is stab. Okay, then we just... Strong Style and should go down. Never mind, it attacks here. Uh oh. Yeah, I knew I- that was a crit! I knew I'd live that, obviously. That's why I played like that. You're quite high level, we're gonna have to use two super potions. Yeah, the Seed of Masteries, we're starting to get more of those, we might want to start using a few of those. I can see them coming in handy. I killed your leader! <laughs> Be weary of me. Yes, yeah, so we at least got an idea too of what kind of Pokemon seem to spawn in the uh, rift thingies. This is where we're gonna try to go in a sec. A quick item check. 
That is an area we've yet to be. Oh, ah! Don't fight me. Cool, I'm so glad I accidentally used a grape ball there. I don't know when I was even on the fucking menu for that, but sure. Oh, that's when I hit Y instead of plus initially. Got it. That's how. Well, at least I know. There you are. The tree! Yes, it is! It's with berries. Hoppo berries. Not sure how useful those are. What Pokemon are you? Get it or Graveler. Oh, I was too far. I didn't even get into the fight. Nah! Now that's what we like to see. Yeah, save me the very mild inconvenience. Um, I'm gonna craft one Great Ball to make up for that one I accidentally used. Ah. Yeah, we're already getting pretty full. But we also gotta buy one more bag space. Okay. So there's no reason we can't go any further in this way, it looks like, so... More Carnivines! Home of Trials. That, why does it sound so dramatic? I have no need to actually catch Carnivines, so I'm not even gonna bother. We're level 10 on them. Oh, Pin Missile here. That's not gonna do enough, is it? I didn't really think that through. Actually, it's unaware. It's fine. You'd have to strong style it, I think. I think that would finish him off. It's just such a weak move. Oh! <gasps> Did a Gumi? I was not expecting to find Gumi here. Holy shit. I get the feeling our team is just suddenly gonna build up fast because that's another Pokemon I wanted to use. Although it depends how rare they are here. Holy shit! Are there a oh, there's a Sligoo! How level are these gonna be? There's a lot of them here! They move so fast! They're kind of hard to catch. They're only level 30 though. Um, try an Aqua Tail. Wow, that uh, did more than I thought it would. We, we might have to actually catch better balls here. We'll see though. It's a Gumi! I was not expecting Gumi to be over here. I want to be honest. I was expecting like. Uh. Petalil. These guys are so goofy looking. Okay, so we go with the, the Aqua Tail strat. Might be pretty effective here. I think Dragon Pulse, dang. I'm not sure what kind of attacker these guys are. They're probably more defensive. We'll have to look at what nature we think is going to be ideal for it. It's like, what, Steel Dragon? Got a pretty damn good defensive typing. 